the entrepreneur that creates this stuff? Are you the marketer that promotes it? Are you a practitioner that delivers it? Are you a manager that operates it? Or are you a CEO that leads your business? Who are you? Because you've got to know what your role is. Let's talk about the old game for a minute. What did we do in the old game? Oh, we ran ads. Yeah, that's helpful. And we, we qualified because we put them in a selling cycle. How many went to sales training? Has anybody read that? Pure sales training from various businesses. You know the worst sentence anyone ever came up with, right? I'm from the home office and I'm here to help you. Okay, not true. Because they have to build things very generic, okay? They, and most of the people that built that stuff never was in the trenches next to a customer asking them for a check. Change your game. So we wanna, I, what I want you to start to think about is, hmm, do I do business the way I've always done business because that's the way it was always done? Or am I willing to make a change? Am I willing to start to think differently? Am I willing to start to talk about my business differently? Because I've said to many people, what business are you in? I get all kinds of crazy answers. But arguably, you're in people, you're in the people and profit business. You gotta, but you're in the people business. And, and a lot of times people think, well, I'm in the, you know, whatever, I'm in the in nutritional supplement business, or I'm in the, the, uh, in the in marketing and, and the internet business. I, I'm gonna disagree with all of you. This is what the, this is the, these are the leverage points. Every single one of you needs to look at this today and decide where am I in this cycle? Where do I need the most help? Where do I need the most help? Do I need help attracting new clients and customers? Do I need help qualifying the ones that I have? Maybe I, maybe I do, maybe I get a lot of dads. Maybe I have, maybe I have a lot of input. Maybe I have a lot of uh, friends, a lot of likes, a lot of followers. But, but am I qualifying those? Am I converting those from prospects into clients? Maybe I'm doing a great job up here, but they're dropping off. I'm not keeping them. How many of you have a database of people or companies or businesses or whatever you want to call them? Somebody that bought something from you in the past that no longer buys from you right now. How many have that right now? Okay. Would you like to know how to make some money with them?